Oh, hi there. Welcome back to the channel. On this channel, myself and brothers and sisters who know these things, we're trying to tell people about the world. The world is biblical. I say that often. It means the Bible is true. Earth is creation. The Bible, we're living and breathing it. It tells us who we are from Genesis, Adam and Eve in the garden. It tells us what the earth is, what creation is. And there's tons of wisdom. There's tons of stories that really happened, except for when there's parables and metaphors. The world truly is biblical. I've been a Christian since 2015, 2016, when I started researching the truth. Instead of giving up on myself, I was very sad and I, <laughs> I was done with this world. I, I was so confused why bad things kept happening. I decided to seek the truth. I wanted to know the meaning of life. And I found that. Wouldn't you know, it's Jesus Christ in the Bible, his word. Jesus Christ lived here 2,000 years ago, born of a virgin, fully man and fully God. He lived a perfect sinless life, and he went to the cross and shed his precious blood, died on the cross for all the sinners in this world. How many sinners are in the world? One, carry the three. Every single person is a sinner except Jesus. That's a lot of people that need salvation. And Jesus Christ is the way, the truth, the life. He is those three things. He is the way. In this video, we're going to look at Tom DeLonge of Blink-182, and we're also going to look at Matt Skiba, who was in, in Blink-182, taking over for Tom here, and he also has his own band, Alkaline Trio. I grew up as a punk rocker, playing guitar and singing and hanging with my friends, playing in the basements, that kind of thing. It was a lot of fun, but I didn't research the biblical world then. I didn't try reading the Bible. I dismissed everything. I believed in God always, but I made up a version of God in my head that does not exist. And that is creating, you know, a false God, worshiping another God. And Jesus Christ is Lord God and Savior. I found that out now. I will never let that go. He is the solid rock and foundation to stand upon for anyone who comes to him. Tom DeLonge has a signature guitar from Fender. Here it is here. And what's he doing? He's doing one eye symbolism, the eye of Horus, using his guitar to darken one eye utterly, doing the eye of Horus. This is Roll Out the Research, San Diego Roll, created by Tom DeLonge of Blink-182. And what is the poster doing? This woman has a piece of sushi darkening one eye utterly, doing the eye of Horus. I know some of this seems goofy, but I'm not doing it. I'm just kind of like reporting on it and noticing it. This is a poster for some event, and the girl is having sushi darken one eye utterly, doing one eye symbolism, the eye of Horus. Tom DeLong is seen here. The truth is out there. He's big into aliens from outer space. Except aliens are fallen angels and demons. There is no outer space, believe it or not. If you research this, you'll find that out. But if you don't, you'll think it's crazy, but you've been brainwashed by the world. It really is something how deep the brainwashing goes. Coming out of it, a lot of people say it's like leaving the matrix, quote unquote, and that kind of thing. So Tom DeLong says the truth is out there, but the Bible says, Jesus saith unto him, I am the way and the truth. So Tom DeLong says the truth is out there, i.e. aliens. But Jesus says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Tom DeLong has a NASA shirt. You know NASA, N-A-S-A. -A. It means to deceive in Hebrew, and N-A-S-A -A stands for not a space agency. And he's got a NASA mug, probably having some coffee, whoop-de-doo. He's got the man sitting on the moon, even though the moon is a light in the sky with no land to land on, but whatever. Here he is. He's got his guitar. He's flipping the bird. And on his guitar, he has the Freemason square and compass with the G in the middle. He's a Freemason. What a surprise. Here he is wearing his apron as a Freemason, and he has the Freemason square and compass as the inlays of his guitar here. So he's a Freemason. 
Matt Skiba, like I said, he took place. He took Tom's place in Blink-182 for a couple years. He has his own band, Alkaline Trio. He's standing in front of Time Magazine, says, Is God dead? No, God is living and breathing. God is our Lord Jesus Christ in heaven. And he's wearing a NASA shirt. You know, NASA, not a space agency. Seems to me these guys love to, to, love to show off their NASA gear, their cups and shirts and whatever. What else does he have? He has a tattoo of the pentagram in the circle, which is a, a very clear satanic symbol. He's doing the Osiris Risen Freemasonry pose. Here is his name, his last name, Skiba, and it has the lightning bolt in the middle. And what does the Bible say? And he said unto them, I beheld Satan as lightning fall from heaven. Lightning? Satan? Lightning? Fall from heaven? And Matt Skiba is hiding his hand in his coat the way a Freemason would do. Tom DeLong got the Freemason square and compass. Matt Skiba hides his hand like a Freemason. But I'm a crazy person, just a crazy Christian believing in a biblical world. How silly am I to trust the Bible over man and science and this, the ways of the world, right? Once you discover this, you know that God is not a liar. God cannot lie. God is telling the truth. He's the same yesterday, today, and forever. You can trust God. What can't you trust? These people and the societies in the world and the world and man and woman and what science says about a lot of things. Is there science in the world? Of course there is. God, God created, the, created earth and the heavens. There's clearly science involved, but you can test that and know that. The science I'm talking about talks about a big spinning space ball that does not exist. It's full of 666 and all that stuff because the Freemasons have deceived everyone. Waking up out of this can be a nightmare. It's hard to believe that the world is this sold out like this, right? You'll probably start hating the things you used to love, but that's okay. If you have Jesus, you have salvation forever, a new heaven, new earth, new glorified body, many wonderful promises of God. Meanwhile, the world hides their hand in their coat because they're just so sneaky like that. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, everyone else, God bless you.